Hello guys and welcome to the third and the last part of this video review series of the Resurrection ROM build 6.8 for Zenfone 5. Now in this build I have flashed the Resurrection ROM build 6.8 along with the Resurrection ROM build 6.5 kernel on top of that. Now it solves a lot of things. The last in the part 2 where we had flashed the X Anwar kernel it had a headphone issue where you know the music would not play in the headphones. It is not present in the kernel for build 6.5 and the build kernel for build 6.5 also solves the battery drain issue so as you can see the battery deep sleep is around 14 hours 29 minutes and it's running at 800 megahertz for five minute five hours so i'll just open up the battery settings one more time okay so here we have the cell standby time is 20 hours and 57 minutes and the screen on time is around 4 hours and 55 minutes but as you can see it has been charged a lot of times so I don't think so those figures are quite relevant in for this video so anyway the battery drain is completely solved okay the Wi-Fi issue is solved you can just turn on and turn off Wi-Fi as many times as you want and there are no screen freezes same goes for the call, call functionality there are no screen freezes even after and during calls no matter who disconnects the call so and the X and R kernel features are gone so if you are flashing the build 6.5 kernel make sure that you know like if you have already flashed the X and R kernel make sure that you just reformat the whole system again flash the R resurrection ROM build and then flash the 6.5 kernel do not flash one kernel over the other as it might not boot this build also does not have the headphones issue so it makes the ROM very stable for use right now so just head over and flash this build 6.5 kernel and all the issues with build 6.8 would go away except of course if you go into settings and if, and if you go down to sim cards and go to sim settings or sim 1 or sim 2 it doesn't matter and if you change the preferred network type to 2g then you will face random screen locks not screen freezes it will just head over to the lock screen no matter you're using wi-fi or 2g so just keep this to 3g and you know if you change it back to 2g that is another bug that hopefully should be fixed in the next build even the flashing the 6.5 kernel does not solve that so that's all for this video thank you guys for watching and the next videos will be on installing the lollipop rom and of course you know a review of the latest firmware of the lollipop rom so if you want more videos like that don't forget to subscribe and hit the like button on this video if you liked it and i'll see you guys in the next one